Asphalt cement is a byproduct of crude oil. The key ingredient they mix with crushed rocks and other minerals to make paving asphalt. Salt production begins at the paving plant's quarry, where some 15 meters below ground, workers driving heavy machinery collect boulders of granite that have been blasted off the rock walls. Trucks transport the rocks to the paving plant, which is right on the quarry site. They dump their cargo into the primary crusher, a machine whose steel jaws crush these big rocks into pieces smaller than 20 centimeters. It takes mammoth force to crush solid rock. The flywheels that amplify the motor's energy weigh more than six metric tons. The primary crusher empties onto a mobile conveyor belt, which transports the crushed rocks to an outdoor storage area. When it's time to make the asphalt, the rocks travel via conveyor belt from the storage area to a screening building to be classified by size. There, the rocks tumble downward over a series of inclined screens whose largest holes are 10 centimeters big. What's too large to drop through goes to a secondary crusher that reduces the rocks to 10 centimeters or smaller, then sends them to a third or tertiary crusher that further reduces them to 2 centimeters or smaller. What's small enough to pass through the screens bypasses the secondary crusher and goes directly to the tertiary crusher. After this last crushing stage, the largest stones are 2 centimeters in size. Everything smaller than 5 millimeters goes in one pile. That includes stone dust created by the crushing process.